Shut up, cow. Hello, everybody. ADDF Toxic here. Uh, welcome back to my hill. I am back over here at the Forest Iron Farm. Today, I'm gonna do a little bit of digging. A little bit of digging. Just have to fix that gravel spot. So I've been uh, digging out this uh, this tunnel here for for the minecarts to go through. Here I got a little bit lazy. I haven't uh, cleared out the th full three by three area yet. That I went way too far. Uh, gravel pocket there. I found a couple interesting looking caves in this area, but they uh, turned out to be duds. So I, I tried recording cave cave in episodes, but. Like I said, they were done, so I threw that footage away. Um, but uh, this is where the digging is going to get interesting. That right there is the ocean. So I'm going to dig through water today. And I'm not sure exactly how this is going to work. We'll see, that is sand, I need my shovel for that. Hmm, that one's gonna flow in here. And basically what I'm gonna do is... Every time I open it up to, uh, to the ocean, I'll just replace the, the ceiling block with glass. But I'll continue digging as normal. I'll make sure I do 3x3 three three here. Um, let me just block the water in here so it doesn't escape on me. So I wanted that there. Not like it's going to stay or anything. That's good. That's going to open up. Mainly this is just going to be really annoying. But I think it's going to look pretty cool when, once I'm done. So last week, uh, in my episode, I was, um, I was talking about the month of October and some things that I'm excited about being released this month. One of that was a, the new James Bond album, which I got on Thursday. I haven't listened to the whole thing yet, but it's... Loving it so far. It's from what, I, what I've listened to of it. Is released. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Oh, crap. Um, there was also the new uh, Veronica Roth book 
uh, a Legion, the third in the series, the Divergent series. Um, and I've definitely been reading that a lot faster than, than the Stephen King book I was reading, but that being said, I am still reading it quite slow because I just haven't had time um, lately to read anything. Yeah, I knew it was going to be kind of a corner shape like this. Because I was looking at the... I was looking at it from outside. It kind of slopes off. And it's kind of a bay there. So... But of course, with the sand falling all the time, it... it you can see there, it's kind of made a bit of a cliff. More of a cliff than it used to. Which is something I didn't think of when I decided to come down here today. But that's... The way it's going to be, I guess. Uh, now I gotta start making the walls as well. Uh, this is where it gets really not fun. No, I don't need an axe here. Let me just put a cobble there. And just block this off for a minute. I'll take that out again later. Digging through sand is one of the most annoying things to do in this game. Making a tunnel underneath the sand. I've I've done it before when I was making the uh, the path to the the cow farm and the pig farm. Where's this water coming from? Glitch. Or it created a source block. What else was their news? Oh, uh, Nexus 5, which I haven't heard anything else of since last week, so I got nothing to comment on there. Um, but the force thing I was saying I was excited about that might come out in October has come out yesterday. And that is Minecraft 1.7. I keep digging that that way, and that's not helping my case. I should dig it from the bottom. So yeah, Minecraft 1.7 came out, um, and uh, I haven't upgraded yet, I'm still, um, still on 164, is it? Yeah. You can see in the top, uh, corner there, oh shit. Forgot to watch my, uh, breath counter. Oh, no, no! That's the other annoying part. And then I'm forgetting to watch that again. Should get an Aqua Affinity helmet. Or a respiration helmet, I mean. Sorry, I was talking about 1.7 1. 1. 7, and I got sidetracked by glass. So yeah, 1.7 came out uh, officially yesterday, I think, and then, um, so uh, after I'm done recording this, I am going to go and start playing 1.7. Oh, that is ridiculous. So is that. Alright, I just got the respond button to work. Oops. 
me sleep. And then let me run back over there and hopefully get my stuff in time. I've been noticing lately that it uh, doesn't... Your stuff doesn't spawn if it's unloaded, which is... I don't know if that's a glitch or if that's some sort of new feature. But I've seen that happen a couple times. So hopefully it happens again here. I'll run anyway as if it's not going to. I have no idea where I am. Oh, uh, yeah, a skeleton. And here's me running around defenseless. And I am going to update uh, this series to 1.7 as well. I'll back it up first, this map, and then... Uh, should grab potatoes. And then go up to 1.7. There will be some, some new features there that will be nice for this uh, map. There's one in particular I can think of right now. I am so out of food that I am... Now walking. And the the terrain might end up looking probably end up looking a bit funny if I explore no. the wrong areas now, but that's uh I don't know where else if I'm really gonna be exploring that much in this map anymore. Don't make me die of starvation. That's it over here. If I can get there in time. Come on, two and a half meat whatever is left. And there's my new tunnel. Now I'm about to drown again. Give me some air. I do not have my potatoes. That's a bad thing to not have yet. Come on! There they are. So let me grab my other stuff here. Potatoes, please give me, let me eat. <sighs> okay. Now let's reorganize a little bit here. Those go there, those go on my feet, that goes there. Um, that goes on my body, that goes there. That's number two. Where's my arrows? I know I picked them up. There they are. Six. And there's the torches. Used axe, which I'll just put there. Helmet need to be put on. See what else I can find here. Man, my stuff really exploded all over the place. Oh 
Alright, this should be that. And that should be there, and that should be there. I think I got everything. Wait. I am missing one shovel. But other than that, that's pretty impressive. It is becoming daytime again out there. What the hell? No, let me out! Let me heal first here. <sighs> That's annoying. Trying to place blocks in the right place. Now I'm just going to take this cobble here, and I'm just going to kind of block off some of this. Again, it seems like it's creating source blocks as it goes, as I mess around with it, so that's kind of what I'm trying to eliminate here, it's those source blocks that shouldn't have been created. Yeah, see, why was there water coming from there? It's it's definitely creating source blocks. Whoops. There we go. Actually, that's uh, coming in from the side here, so let me just block that off with the glass. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Whoops, what the hell. Let me just put that light up there. There. This is so tiring. And then it recreated that one again. unfortunate, but I had to break that. I still don't have a silk touch. And it is night time again. Come on, place. That's not the block I wanted to place, though. 
Alright, got that one out of the way. Here, let's make a floor out of glass there. Let me just block that off with cobble. And since it's created some source blocks there, let me just do that. And then I can get rid of those again. Get rid of that. And there we go with that. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Here I want a glass there and... Aqua Affinity would be nice here too, actually. I should keep track of how many times I drowned trying to do this. And that count starts at 1 with this episode. I think I can place that wall there. Yep. Water's still flowing in from here. And I can't get to that. I can place a floor there. A floor there. Wall there, not there. At least I'm getting a bunch of sand from this to replace all the glass that I'm breaking from bad placement. And I can place a floor block there. There we go. Those will likely get washed away, but... Oh, this looks, uh... pretty bad at the moment. I'll have to make this a bit more of a steady block type later, particularly the floor. Maybe even that. No, that's sand on top. I don't want to mess with that. I don't know. I'll figure something out. There's still a couple blocks on top. Okay, I gotta eat. After digging this tunnel here, uh, digging out the rest of this tunnel is going to seem like nothing. Come on. Alright, got some air. Like I said, I'm probably going to drown a lot during this project. Especially if I fall like that. Let me in. There we go. It's so annoying moving in water, it just makes it even worse. Okay, let me just block this. 
this off here. Excess source blocks go away. Oops. Oops. anything. Okay, so that's one thick layer wall, which is good. Now let me just put this floor in. There's a torch doing a dance. One, two, three, four. Aha! I have torch on the glass now. I gotta go outside and uh, fix those. Why did I dig that from the top? I was not thinking. Managed to do that without drowning, and there's a zombie coming for me. Oh. Come on. place torches there apparently. Well that's interesting to know. Could be helpful I guess. Here's another idea. If I have this uh, wall here at the end, then I could just go around and just place on the edge of the wall and I'm going to drown. I should really place my spawn out uh, at the farm here so that when I drown I don't have to come all the way from home again. I'll just finish this circle. Got I got a little bit more of a system going here now that I'm uh, in the actual tunnel rather than just emerging from the tunnel so this it's making it a little bit easier. That wall really isn't making it easy to get out, though. Um, I gotta take that down. Shit. Torch! Zombie's just going for a swim there. No worry.
Well, um, I'll continue working on this uh, tunnel through water. At some point. But first I'm gonna go record my first episode in 1.7. And I'm not sure when I plan on, on uh, actually releasing that episode yet. But, uh, when I do release it, come join me. And in the meantime, have a good life.